Hey guys, and CS Fan 001 here. I believe this is part 40 of Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. So, last time we pretty much finished killing off all the great cons, and this time I'm gonna do something a little different. This part is going to be an edited hunt for some special items, and I believe you guys probably know what those special items happen to be. Let's see how many we've got of them. Our star caps, we have 38 total, and we need 50. So, I thought now might be a decent time to go and start hunting for them. So, this is going to be edited after, like, as soon as I get this uh, first set of them, this is going to be pretty much edited, because I know you guys probably don't want to watch this. So, yeah, I'll basically be going around, I'll discover some new locations, etc., etc., Okay, okay, yep, Old World Blues has now been downloaded. Just thought I'd go ahead and do that in between the last couple videos. So, yep, Old World Blues and Honest Hearts coming up soon. But actually, I'm going to do a sort of a mid-game update soon to discuss those things in sort of a better way, let you guys know exactly what my plans are for it and for the rest of the Let's Play, because I've sort of planned out what I want to do for the rest of the Let's Play in terms of, like, side quests and stuff. So I just thought that that'll be a, uh, a video or two from now, but first we want to go ahead and start collecting some of the star caps and go ahead and, well, collect star caps. Like I said, it's not much more to it. Okay, so are we where I'm looking to? Hey, wait a second, that's the entrance to Lonesome Road up there. Yeah, that's the entrance to Lonesome Road. Well, that's not where we're going. I thought this is where the drive-in is. There's the drive-in. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, up there's the entrance to the freaking Lonesome Road DLC. We're not doing that. Oh, of course, the one thing I didn't want to take is what I took. There's one of our star caps. There are supposed to be two here. Ooh, a standard bottle cap at least. Yeah, there we go, guys. Two more star caps. Meaning, 40 down, 10 to go. So, I'll meet you guys at the next location. Okay, I know there's not a star cap here, but since this is on route to one of our uh, star caps that we're looking for, and actually I... Well, there was a star cap here, okay. Uh, I guess there was a star cap here, so two for the price of one at this point. Uh, I don't know how I missed that. Okay, so what I want to do here is lockpick this average lock that we didn't get through before. I just want to see what's in it. Well, that was about as useless as it could be. Jeez. Well, we still got a star cap out of it, so let's continue on. Okay, so we should now be approaching our next cap. Uh, I got some Nevada Agre fruits there. Right up here is our next location. It's just a, it's basically straight north of the Mojave Outpost. Maybe, and I uh, got some enemies here. Fantastic. Well, at least you guys get to see me kill some enemies and grab some poison glands to sell. And actually, there's a few different things we can scavenge here. We can scavenge this little thing first, though I don't think there's too much in here. I just, I do want to check, though. All right, so that thing's empty. Yes, there are giant rad scorpions in this game, but there are no albino rad scorpions in this game, which is really awesome, to say the least. I mean, the lack of freaking albino rad scorpions is awesome, and I also don't believe there are feral... No, wait, I believe there are feral ghoul reavers, but I believe they're only in one of the DLCs. Yeah, I believe they're in the uh, Lonesome Road DLC. So we're now here. Let's look around, shall we? Uh, we could camp out if we wanted, but I don't... Actually, I wonder if I can make anything. Just curious. Nah. Okay, we got empty whiskey bottles, a toolbox. Let's see if there's anything worth money in there. Nope. Nothing. Well, that sucks. Looking for extra equipment as well. But there's our star cap. Come on. Uh, center over it. Thank you. Uh, we got anything else in here of value? Okay. That was a bit unusual. Ah, uh, well, that's it for that location. Let's go somewhere else. 
Okay, our next location, it's a little tricky to find because it's sort of up in the mountains where you would typically see, you know, invisible walls and stuff. And I believe it's actually got water in it as well. If this is actually, yes, it is. It is irradiated. So when you're up here, you're going to want to have something to help out with the radiation, probably. I wonder if I've got any rad axes. Kind of need to check for that. Uh, I also want to pull out something that's going to do a little more damage up here. So let's see what we've got in here. I hope I've got some uh, anti-radiation cams, or I might have to buy some or something. I don't know why I ate that. Uh, what have we got? And I walked right past it. Rat away and rat X. But eventually I'm just going to get it healed by the followers of the apocalypse because it's cheaper. I've dis I have completed a challenge. Oh, cool. Walker of the Mojave. 50 locations discovered. Very cool. Wow, is it just me or does that place look a lot like Good Springs? Oh, here are some Feral Ghoul Reavers. That's right. They're just, they are in the game. They're just about a million times weaker than they used to be. Feral Ghoul Reavers are nothing in this game compared to that how they were in uh, Fallout 3. As you, as you can see, hunting shotguns taking them out in just a few shots. And they also don't do too much damage either, which is a nice thing. Just die. Nobody likes you. Just get out of here. Seriously, this isn't even that good of a gun, and we're still killing him so easily, so yeah. And holy cow, he hit me pretty badly there with that uh, radiation-style strike or whatever. Okay, so we've reached the building. Algae or... No, that's not algae, but whatever, it's growing. Yeah, I wonder why it's called that. Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha. Oh well. Oh crap! Where'd you come from? Irradiated food. Like I really want that. Oh well. Maybe I can find someone that'll buy it. Ooh, a DC Journal of Internal Medicine and a Weapons Repair Kit. That's actually really good. What's this? A briefcase with crap in it. Yeah, this place looks a lot like Megaton. Eh, nothing really worth taking out off of him. Craze Mr. Handy. Alright. Okay, we've searched everything down there. Let's head upstairs. Ooh, a chessboard. Any normal caps on it? Nope. Oh well. Got a bed here. Hmm. Wonder where it is. I must have missed it in the kitchen before, so that's the only place I can think of. Oh, yep, yeah, here it is. Got it. Get out of my way, Eddie. All right, very nice. So that should be like 42-ish. Man, this is going to end up being like a really long video. Oh, hello. You kind of, hey, okay, never mind. I'll let you kill him yourself. Wow, he just got, like, freaking airborne. Wow, that was actually kind of cool. Now, there is another one here in this general area, but I'm not exactly sure where it is. It's underneath, like, a tent or something in the nearby area, but I don't remember, like I just said, I don't know where that tent is. So I'm going to see if I can find it. And wow, I am not used to being heavily irradiated. Oh, well. Not a big deal. Just radiation. I can get it fixed whenever I want. Whoa, what's this? Oh, this might actually be it. Oh, whoa, whoa. Where the heck? Ooh, I want that. Ah. Uh, now I'm a bit worried. That was a bit of a surprise. I want to take a stem bag just to make sure I can survive for a second. Ow. Whoa, ambush or something. 
Well, I have the assumption that if there was a star cap here, it is probably long gone by now. I'm glad I caught that on recording, but I'm also... That was actually kind of scary, because... I wasn't really expecting that big of a freaking explosion. But I mean, according to my guy that I've got pulled up... It's supposed to be in here. So it's long gone. Crap. Well, that sucks. Oh well. Guess that's it for this. Okay, our 44th star cap is right in here. We're gonna s steal some healing powder. Well, it's not technically stealing if you need it. Uh, leather armor. Well, that would be good if it was still fairly early in the game, but unfortunately that's kind of useless to us now. Take some ammunition. Oh, wow. Now that's actually a lot of good stuff. Aside from the ashtrays that I probably didn't need, but oh well. Ah, uh, that's actually in really good condition. But our star cap and a normal bottle cap are right in there. So that's a pretty easy one. We're actually pretty close to the bottom of the map, if you look at the map. So that's it for the raided farmstead, so let's keep moving. Only six to go. Okay, so our next location is Bradley Shack, I believe is the name of it. If I remember correctly, one of these guys has a Gatling laser, or there is a Gatling laser here. So, I definitely want to clear it all out. This gun is probably unnecessary for fighting these guys, but, you know, it's faster. Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, between segments, I actually got, uh, what's it called? The, uh, four, I think it's the 10,000 damage with, what is it, with, uh, guns. Challenge completed, so yeah. Pretty good, even though, I mean, it's not that big a deal, but, you know, still, it's, it's worth some XP's, so I'd like to have that. And it would also be worth a, uh, trophy if you still needed the trophies. Okay, so let's search this place out up here. Nothing up there. It's... Ah, there's the flag of the United States. Yes, it's, I believe, 13 stars for the 13 districts and another... That did not sound good. Aha! That's what it was. And then a third and then a 14th star right in the center and that central star is supposed to be the federal government maze barrel cactus fruit a cowboy repeater oh no it's a bb gun and ammo that's phasing through the floor Oh, we got all that. There's the star cap. That is exactly what we were looking for. Ooh, we got a very easy lock as well. Let's see what's in here. See if it's anything of value. Ooh, wow, that was actually really good. I'm curious as to what's up here or why it's like this. Eh, doesn't look like anything. Hmm. Well, looks like that's it here, but that was actually a lot of good equipment, now that I think about it. So yeah, I think that's 45, so we've only got 5 to go. So I guess that there's a few different places we could go to. The Repcon test site actually has a lot of stuff at it, but it also requires... Or, no, it's just... I can't remember which one it is, but it's Repcon something. That might be a good place to go, but I'll see you guys in a minute. What I just had to go through, that was so freaking awful, it's not even funny. God, game developers, don't you think those ghouls were a bit overpowered? I mean, my god, I had to run around there for 10 minutes using every weapon I had and about 10 stim packs and like all of my food and a whole bunch of other crap as well to do anything. Seriously, game. These things were freaking overpowered. Just a couple of them at once? No, that's no big problem. Not at all. However, when you put ten of them on me at once, 
and the fact that they all run at the speed of a freaking death claw nearly. My armor's wrecked to the point where it's never gonna work very well again. God, that is just, that is so much crap, it is not even funny. Man, that is just, I don't know what to say. That was so much bull crap. There's like 20 freaking ghouls there. Oh, that's not good. I'm on a high radiation level. That's probably not a good thing. Let's get into this shack real quick. Oh, my computer is low on memory. Like, I really care. Oh, crap. Actually, I probably should because I'm... The star cap, get out. I am not going to risk anything. I'm getting the star cap and getting out. I think now, before the next segment, I'm going to head back to Freeside and the gun... Or, I'm going to head back to Freeside and buy some stim packs and stuff to trade with. Because that was a very, very painful segment right there. Okay, I finally got through with healing and everything, so... Pretty much, I didn't really get to buy any ammo or anything, but I at least got to heal up, and my character is definitely in better shape now. Still got some weapons that aren't in super great condition, but uh, I got nine stim packs, and I repaired my armor, but it cost 5,900 caps, so I'm out currently, I think, 4,800 caps from after trading and everything. So I gotta try to make some money back. But, you know, we did it. I got through there, and I got a star cap for it. I would say that's probably one of the toughest star caps in the entire game. Okay, we'll worry about that later on. But we've only got four star caps to go, and then, well, we'll be able to complete the Legend of the Star. And believe me, am I happy for that to be coming up, because collectathons are not fun. But now we are at the Matthews Animal husbandry farm which is in a pretty easy to get to location i do want to check in here and make sure there, see if there's anything in here Ooh, uh well torn diary pages that i really could care less about looking for you know guns ammunition food water stim packs stuff that you actually need i think this place has some food or something stored in it though that we can take so it's kind of cool because these guys won't attack you. You can just walk right by them because they're nice like that. It's pretty much anything that I can sell for a decent amount of money. I know that my computer is low on memory space, even though it's actually not. Uh, let's see, anything I can sell for money. Ooh, wow, that's actually some good stuff. Wow, there was some actually really good stuff in there. That's worth some money, and I want to put that cup in there because I'm not exactly going to be carrying that around. Okay, so let's check this other one now, but yeah, that's a lot of good gear. I definitely could use that, but I prefer a few normal stim packs over some super stim packs because I don't usually use the super stim packs. I think half the time I forget about them. There's our star cap and our bottle cap. Another Torn Diary page. Ooh, a Wasteland Survival Guide. Cool. Uh, let's go ahead and read that and bump up our survival. But now we only have three to go. So, yeah. See you guys for the next one. Okay, so we are now at the Hunter's Farm for our next couple of items. Want to grab everything off of this dead guy that we found. And he had a lot of good gear on his body. And so does this one. Uh, anything else of value? Nothing really. Oh crap, it's a Legion patrol. That sucks. Uh, I'm not gonna worry about the Legionaries at this exact moment. Instead, I'm just gonna... Oh wow, they're such idiots. They're all just fighting Eddie. Hey, get owned. Take a hit. Come on. So this is the first Legion patrol we've seen on this file. Now, I mean, of course we've seen one really early on in the other original file. Now, you see, why can't you idiots, my followers, why can't you guys actually help me out and, like, why couldn't you have helped out like this when I needed it before with the, uh, I don't even know what that quest is. 
when I really, really needed your help earlier on to uh, kill off all those ghouls and stuff and you made me waste so much gear. I have no idea what either of those quests are, but I'm... Well, I failed a bunch of quests. Wow, dude, are you gonna hit anybody today? now vilified by the Legion. Awesome, because I hate the Legion anyway. Actually, no, that's not true. I don't hate the Legion at all. But I hate them in this file, and that's what matters. So let's do some uh, repairing here. This is actually going to make me some money back. Yeah, I'm going to be able to sell a fair amount of this stuff to make some money back. Trust me, I need it. Oh, sweet. I don't... I can uh, actually... Now, I'll repair those. I'd rather have a good weapon. Ton of dynamite to sell. Ooh, I want to repair that for sure. Keep the other 10 millimeter for now. Okay, that was actually pretty good. I'm glad they attacked, because look at how much gear we got out of it. I mean, geez, we should be able to sell a fair amount of stuff out of that, including some legion money eventually. But more importantly, we're coming into this building, and we have two star caps in this building. And let's see, I don't believe they're in this room, actually. But we do have a carton of cigarettes. That's good for selling. Nice work, guys. You actually helped out for once. And now, get out of my way, Eddie. Come on. That was difficult. What's in the refrigerator? A lot of drinks. Ooh, we can sell that. There's no doubt about that. And I see a big cluster of bottle caps. And I saw some star caps in there. And a lot of sarsaparillas. Uh, I believe that's going to give us 49. Let's check. Uh, actually, go down, go down. Okay, 49. Well, let's drink these last few sarsaparillas and hope that one of them gives us the star cap. If not, though, there's plenty of other places we can go. Come on, please. Dang it. Well, we only need one more, and I can think of a few good places to go for that last one. So, only one to go. Alrighty, guys. The final star cap should be right around here. It's in one of these buildings. I'm not sure exactly which one. Okay, well, this is the closest one we can enter, but I just went to this uh, place called Durable Dun Sack Caravans or whatever. Eh, it wasn't too big of a place wasn't too important, but uh, there were a few things I scavenged from there, including some combat armor, which now belongs to Boone. As you can see, he's now wearing it. The combat armor is better than that metal armor he was wearing, at least in my opinion, but hmm, I may have come to the wrong place. Ooh, a lot of food. Yep, this does not appear to be it. Dang it. Well, let's keep looking in the area, because we will find it. This is basically in the middle of nowhere, and it should be pretty easy to find. Okay, let's try this house. So it's in the mailbox, actually. Wow, a lot of stuff in there. I can definitely take that. It's worth some money. This is it, yes. This is it, guys. This is exactly where we want to go. Isaac, isn't he the guy for, that works for the Gunrunners? I hear the Great Khans just packed up and left Red Rock Canyon. Always thought the NCR and them would fight it out again. Well, more like I wiped them all out, but yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that was our 50th star cap, guys. That is every star cap that we need. Now, I believe there's a total of 100 in the game. But those are all the ones that we actually need, which is really, really good, because finally, after, and this has been a long thing of, this is going to require a lot of editing on my part, it's been a long day, I've been playing forever, but it should all edit together quite well. So guys, next time, we will head off to the Sunset Sarsaparilla headquarters, and complete the Legend of the Star. See you guys then.